Twelve here, and welcome back to another product review. Today we are checking out Munch Pack once again because they were nice enough, or they're kind enough, to send me another Munch Pack to review for you guys. Because they know as much as I do, I love doing these reviews for you guys and these unboxings, of course. So I got two: one that they had sent me, and one I had paid for. So. I had done a three month subscription, a prepaid subscription for three months and it was like $104 US. So by the time they actually, I actually did that, they had contacted me wanting to send me another box. So I was like, yes, of course, because I like getting these munch packs. If I could get one for free, that's even bonus. So here is the munch pack they have sent me and we're going to do this one and we're going to do the other one another time. So when you open the box. It says download the Munchpack snack scanner. So what this scanner does is if you have snacks in this box that you do enjoy a lot and you guys want more of those snacks, you can scan the actual snack and you can purchase uh, by the bulk. So if you want two or three or four or five or even if you want a 12 and if, because you have family coming over, then you can do that. So you can buy snacks uh, from their actual app. So every month you get one of these cards just telling you, just letting you know who uh, actually put your munch pack together. And mine was made by Jason. So Jason at Munch Pack, thank you very much for putting this munch pack for me. And I like these wrappers. I think I'm gonna start putting these together on the wall. Guys, I think these are kind of cool. So we're gonna get first snack. So I thought this was kind of neat when I when I saw this for the first time in the box. So I'm gonna get this one out of the way, and it's like a monkey, like clapping with these symbols, and there's like candy in it. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to review this. Let's see if I can open this. But it's like little candies. I think I'm gonna I'm just gonna leave it like this because really it's candies. It's you can't really go any more detailed as much as what I have done right now. It's just candy. So thank you very much Munch Pack for sending me this. It's kind of cool. So let's get on to the other snacks. Go on to our first actual snack. So we're gonna do Takis. And the funny thing is I've never had Takis in my life. So this is gonna be my first time having Takis. And these are the zombie habanero and cucumber tortilla chips. So these are the zombie nitro flavor. So habanero, you know, this is even hotter than jalapeno. Actually, that's oh, pretty good. And of course, when you're talking about zombies, it has to be green. So let's try this. I have to be really honest, it's tangy. It's getting this, oh, spicy. It's getting really spicy. And I'm not used to spicy food. So it's weird. It's a very weird taste. You get that aftertaste too. Oh, wow. No, I, actually, I don't like these. And from what I heard, Takis are really popular. I think if I had the actual barbecue flavor or other flavors besides habanero and cucumber. No, I'm sorry, I do not like this. This, I'm gonna give this a one out of five. Surprising, I think this is like the first time in a while that I've rated something one out of five. It has a weird aftertaste. You can definitely taste the cucumber. The cucumber is definitely there. The spiciness from the habanero is definitely there as well. So first thing you get is that uh, weird flavor of cucumber. Second snack, we got Pikachu. And I'm not even sure what this is, but it's product of Japan. So I'm not sure. I'm assuming it's something with strawberry and watermelon. Well, this is very easy to open. Okay. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. I don't know if this is our soft or hard. The outer shell of this candy is a hard. 
but it's soft in the middle. Definitely the strawberry and watermelon flavor. A Pikachu candy. I'd be able to read, if I could read this, I'd probably tell you what sort of like candy this is, but this is all in Japan, so I really don't know what, what it says. But for ratings, I'm going to give this a 3 out of 5. They're pretty good. Next snack is this Cowtail Crispy M. I'm not sure what that is. Crispy. Okay, it's a crispy rice with cowtail bits. So essentially, it's a rice rice crispy with little bits of I'm assuming cowtail, but they're probably not being realistic. Like it's not actual cow cowtail, but to make it look like it's cowtail. Wow, actually smells pretty good. Look at that. Looks like a rice rice crispy with some sort of drizzle and a little nougats on top. If I can get a piece of nougat. Tastes like butterscotch. Maybe caramel? Let's try it. This is actually pretty good. I recommend this, this cow tail. I'm not sure what's on it, but it says crispy rice with cow tail bits. I wonder what the bits are. A four out of five for this, definitely it's pretty good. So with this one, this box that they had sent me, I got tea. And you guys all know, I have this new segment called Coffee Time coming shortly. And with every box that I bought, I've gotten coffee. I paid five dollars extra and I got a pack of coffee. Well this one, I'm assuming that they've seen that I've had coffee a lot and uh, they probably wanted to send me something different. So they sent me this pineapple tea, which I'm going to review as a drink review uh, in the nearest future. So stay tuned, watch for my social media, that way I can keep you guys posted when you guys can see this. So next snack is these Chew Wits. I think that's what it says, Chew Wits. Black currant flavor. Flavor of black currant. Okay, that looks like these, uh, what, what do you call them? Starburst? Yeah, they kind of do like, like Starburst or Star. I'm not sure if that, that's how it's pronounced. But, square little candy. A little hard. It is a chewy candy. These are pretty good. I used to love Starburst. Or Star, yeah, Starburst. I used to love Starburst as uh, growing up as a kid, and uh, my favorite flavor, I think, was a cherry flavor. This is definitely a great flavor, the black currant. It's a chewy candy, like I said, but it's great flavors, and it kind of just melts in your mouth as you kind of like keep chewing it. So definitely, this is really good. I definitely recommend it. Four to five. Okay, so next snack we have is these circus clowns so this is like almost like a pack of gummy bears or gummy worms but these are circus clowns i love gummies so i'm gonna like this i'm for sure okay so they look like circus clowns but like gummies And there's different colors of clowns. There's a yellow and blue. There's a white and green. There's a white and pink. Definitely the, the circus clowns gummies are really good. Great flavors. I definitely like that chewiness. Four and a half out of five. Definitely these are fantastic and you guys must try this. Okay, so now we have these ripples. So, from what it says, sour cream and onion flavor, I'm taking out that these are, yep, yeah, these are potato chips with real bites. And it says right here, additional information, su suitable for vegetarians. So, all those vegetarians, 
You guys can have this. Hmm. Smell it. Sour cream and onion chips. It has a nice crunch. Great flavors of sour cream and onion. What more can I really say about chips? They're, they're salty, they're great flavors of sour cream and onion. They're nice and crisp. I'm gonna give this a five out of five. Really, there's nothing wrong with this. Okay, so we have these bonbons. I'm not sure if that's what it's called. But these are from Product of France. So, or I should say, because I'm French, bonbon is like bonbon. So bonbon means like candy, if you were to say that in French. Okay. They smell like strawberry. Yeah, the strawberry. Artificial flavor. So that's what they look like. They start a bit hard, and then it gets to chewy. These are pretty good. I definitely recommend those. Yeah, two more snacks. We got this, uh, I can't pronounce this. This is Chinese again. Chinese or Japanese. So, and then we got these Chiki Choco Banano. So it's chocolate and banana cookie, I'm assuming. Oh yeah, definitely smell that chocolate. Okay, so it's some chocolate and the actual cookie right there. This actually tastes like chocolate and banana. At least actually pretty good. Yeah, the cookies, very chocolatey, and that has that nice, like, buttery texture for a cookie. But the chocolate is nice and not overly sweet, but it just has that nice creaminess and nice sweetness to it. And that banana flavor is really coming through. Definitely check those out. So we got now these, this tube. I really don't know what it is. Okay. Okay. I don't really know what that smells like. I would have to try it. This is strange, but it melts in your mouth. You take a bite in it, and I think they have peanut butter in here. It's like a very a log cookie. It tastes like sesame seed. If that's possible. Is, is this even, look at this, it tastes like sesame seed butter, I think. Yeah, this is very, it's a weird texture. It melts in your mouth. It has a sesame seed flavor. And I'm just guessing because the, the wrapper doesn't really tell me much because it's all in thinking Chinese or Japanese. Maybe it's soy nuts, sesame seed soy nuts. And that's what it tastes like, like some sort of like soy butter or, or sesame seed butter. It is literally melts in your mouth. You take a bite, and it literally melts, melts in your mouth. Wow, this is pretty good. I'm amazed with all these snacks. All of these snacks were fantastic. I definitely uh, liked the uh, the melting butter, <laughs> like cookie in your mouth. I like the banana and chocolate uh, cookie. I also loved the Chewies, the circus clowns. Uh, the only thing I did not like is the Takis. Just my preference. I do not like cucumber flavor and habanero. It's just I don't like them. So. Maybe there's 10 snacks, so nine snacks were fantastic. And I definitely recommend you guys to check out Munch Pack. I will leave a link to Munch Pack in the description with a link. You guys can get a $3 off for your first box code. Click on the link at channelboy12.munchpack.com. Click that link and get your $3 off and get your first Munch Pack. I definitely recommend it. All of this is a must try you guys will enjoy it so hope you guys did enjoy this review as always if you guys did you guys want to see more much back reviews give this video a thumbs up subscribe to continue seeing more much back reviews like this one 
All my links to my social media will be in the description. Tell you follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook for upcoming reviews, vlogs, and of course, cooking videos. So until next time, peace out.